Now, the United Nations Security Council will hold a quote-unquote closed-door meeting on Kashmir today. The meeting will take place at 10 a.m. local time in New York, which is around 7.30 p.m. India time today. Let's first tell you why this meeting is taking place. The request for the meeting has come from China. As you know, Pakistan's Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi dashed to Beijing days after India revoked the special status of the Indian status of Jammu and Kashmir. Pakistan has found very little international support on this matter so far and Pakistan is desperate to show its people that it is doing something on Kashmir. Beijing is Islamabad's all-weather ally and has written to the UNSC at Pakistan's request. It has asked for informal closed-door consultations. So what is a closed-door informal consultation? Diplomats say consultations are ways for Security Council members to informally take up an issue and the closed quote-unquote, refers to the fact that the consultation is not open to the public and no record of statements are kept. Also, let's point out that the meeting does not take place in the UNSC hall that we see ever so often during formal meetings. Today's meeting will take place in the consultation room. The format of the meet also means that Pakistan cannot participate in the meeting. Just to clarify, it is not an emergency meeting. Now, what will this meeting focus on? The discussions will be focused on how the council should react to Pakistan's letter to the UNSC. Pakistan had written to the United Nations Security Council, or UNSC, asking for an emergency session. It had called New Delhi's move unilateral and illegal. After repeated snubs by the international body, Pakistan's Foreign Minister Shah Mahmood Qureshi had asked Pakistanis to not live in a quote-unquote fool's paradise by expecting the UNSC to wait with garlands to support Islamabad's contentions on Kashmir's special status. Do remember that China is the only P5 member who has openly backed Pakistan. Russia has unequivocally endorsed India's argument that its decisions on Jammu and Kashmir were its internal affairs. And Poland which by rotation is the current chair of the Security Council for the month of August, has also said that it hopes that the matter is resolved bilaterally. In fact, the Polish ambassador to India spoke to Weon World is One and said that even the European Union is of the same view. According to United Nations records, the last time the Security Council addressed the dispute between India and Pakistan over the territories of Jammu and Kashmir, under agenda item, the India-Pakistan question was in the year 1964-65. The UNSC has not discussed the issue of Kashmir since India and Pakistan signed the Shimla Agreement in the year 1972. India has firmly maintained that the pact left no scope for the United Nations or any other third party to play any role in resolving its bilateral dispute.